Over the next few minutes, you will see a video that will highlight some of these important capabilities and advantages provided by IronCAD's innovative design. First, we will show the excellent performance of the innovative design methodology. On the right side of the screen is IronCAD, and on the left side is one of the mainstream feature history-based CAD systems. In the IronCAD window on the right-hand side is a catalog of building elements. You use these elements by dragging and dropping them into the design environment, at which point you can easily change the design element type as well as changing its parameter values to modify the element. Also, the geometry of this element can be modified freely by using handles to dynamically resize it or by entering precise values. When working with these elements, you can use a powerful tool called the tri ball to position elements again either in a freeform conceptual mode or precisely. Whether it's the tri ball or an element's handles, you can easily refer to other existing geometry and conveniently position the element or modify its geometry relative to the existing geometry in the scene. The catalog can contain additive or subtractive features. It also can contain parts, assemblies, and even animations as well as users' custom-built catalog elements. It is the combination of designing directly in 3D, the catalog's drag and drop design creation capabilities, as well as our convenient tools such as the tri ball and the handles, which gives IronCAD its excellent performance. Also, notice that during the design you see limited usage of 2D sketch profiles in the building of this part and no use of any engineering design intent. However, these can all be used when and if the designer prefers. What you are viewing is a subset of a comparison we conducted with two mainstream feature history CAD systems. We invited an expert of each system to create a model in that particular system. We also invited an engineering college student who has no 3D CAD experience to participate. He trained on each system for one day and then created the same model in each system. All these comparisons show consistent results, which is when using the innovative design methodology of IronCAD, the design time is about half as what is needed when compared to these other CAD systems. And this really comes from designing directly in 3D combined with the innovative and powerful tools within IronCAD. Besides the performance aspect of design, Equally important is flexibility and collaboration. On the screen is a supporting bracket. It's built completely with feature history as you can see in the browser tree on the left hand side. Now we need to use this bracket as a flat base supporting an object in a vertical orientation. The best way to do it is to make a modification using direct modification. Here we just rotate the desired faces to a different location and all the affected features are converted into the new BREP feature that you can see here on the left hand side named BREP 11. We continue the modification by making edits to the part for the bracket so we can support the vertical object. Again, we use the tri ball to position the faces of these features. As you can see, the system shows you a preview of the direct editing results and highlights the features that will be affected by the direct modification with a magenta highlight. Also, the system asks the user to confirm if this is really what they want to do. If the user confirms this modification, then the system will take care of all the changes. In this process, the designer only needs to focus on doing the modification they want to achieve the desired task. As shown here, the two direct modifications made BREP 11 and BREP 12 two new features created for those affected features and they are easily integrated with other feature types, a very unique feature only available in IronCAD. They are separate in the history tree and are mixed and inserted with other unaffected features in the model's history. This means the users can focus on creating their design without worrying about when they should be using the direct modification, when they should be using the feature definition to do the change, and they do not have to worry about how the history being updated. 
IronCAD does all the work for them. The unaffected features can then be used by their initial definition for future modifications. The resulting part can be dragged and dropped into a catalog and reused in any other design. Here we are using the try ball to position the updated design and then using in place direct modification handles to modify the supporting face to match the height of the supported object. Next we use the try ball to very quickly create a new linked instance to support the other side. This action of using an existing object and dynamically modifying it can be done not only with parts created in IronCAD, but also any imported part. With certain imported file formats, IronCAD can even maintain the association with the original part files. When those parts are modified in the native CAD system, all the user has to do is update the part and all the associated files, 2D drawings, and linked assemblies will be updated automatically.